The fourth phase, design, is all about working on the design of the restoration. In this first part, we will show you how to adapt restoration parameters, select the tooth shape, and position the restoration. In the second part, you will discover how to customize the restoration. First of all, you should check the parameters for your restoration elements. The spacer describes the space for the cementation material on the fitting side of the restoration. Different spacers can be set for the radial and occlusal surfaces. With the occlusal milling offset, you can raise or lower material over the entire occlusal surface. Reduce the value if your restorations often need occlusal adjustment. The proximal contact strength determines the strength in mesial or distal direction. The occlusal contact strength determines the strength in occlusal direction. The preset values can be entered directly in the field or adjusted by using the slider. Please note that the values set here only refer to the current restoration. This step is optional. If you bypass this step, the standard system parameters will be applied. Dynamic contact strength describes the contact during lateral movements in the mouth. The minimal radial thickness depends on the material. 700 microns is appropriate for the zirconia used here. The same applies to the minimal occlusal thickness. You can apply the changed parameters directly to the second crown by clicking on Apply for Similar Restoration Elements. Confirm your changes by pressing OK. Select whatever further elements you wish to set the parameters in the Restoration Selector. In our example, we now adapt the parameters for the Pontic. Depending on the parameters selected, the view on the Pontic also changes. Occlusal contact points can be easily identified by the colored markings, and the strength can be adapted accordingly. Confirm your changes by pressing OK. The changes were saved. We now proceed to the next step, morphology. CEREC Premium always first proposes a restoration calculated by Biogenerics. You can, however, also use one of the proposals from the Tooth database. First, select the manufacturer followed by the desired form. In our example, we stay with the biogeneric morphology in order to show you all the advantages of CEREC Premium and are now proceeding to the next step. In the positioning step, you can change the positioning of the restoration. Note the colored surfaces. The dark blue and green to red areas show the strength of the contact points. To this end, the tools Position and Rotate and Scale are available. See here how the restoration can be scaled by using the arrows. We are now changing to the Position and Rotate tool. And we rotate the restoration by again using the arrows.
Once you have completed positioning the restoration, you can allow calculation of the proposal. At present, only the preparation margin would be taken into account here. The proposal is calculated by clicking on Edit Restoration. For details on how to process this further, see the second part of the design phase. Thank you very much for your attention. We would like to wish you every success while working with CEREC Premium.